Item number SCP-971 Object Class Safe Special Containment Procedures SCP-971 is to be kept in its labeled file folder and locked in file cabinet number 26 in Site-19's file vault when not being used for testing. Keys to both the file vault and file cabinet number 26 are held by on-site senior administrative members and access to SCP-971 for testing is to be allowed only with explicit written permission from Level 4 personnel or higher. Due to potentially harmful environmental impacts, the testing of SCP-971 may not be scheduled more than once a week. Instances of SCP-971-1 have no special properties other than their mode of delivery and may be disposed of normally. Description. SCP-971 is an old and worn delivery menu printed on a standard sheet of 21.6 cm by 28 cm or 8.5 by 11 inches of printer paper. The name of the delivery service is listed as Quick and Ready Meals. No records of such a business exist, and the parent company named on the menu denies ownership of said food delivery service. The menu lists the company name, a phone number, 1-800 and several different food items, each preceded by an item code. The food items are typical fast food items, including hamburgers, chicken sandwiches, chicken fingers, assorted seasoned fries, and carbonated beverages, all brand sodas. The menu features no pictures or prices of the food, and the typeface and design are both minimum and simplistic. When holding SCP-971 and calling the phone number listed, the caller will be sent to an automated menu system. Note, calling the same phone number without holding the menu will send the caller to a help desk for software. The phone number listed on the menu corresponds to that company's listed phone number for their help desk. The automated menu will prompt the caller to input the item codes for the food they desire, and then for their credit card number to pay for the order. Once item codes and credit card numbers are input, the automated system will tell the caller the total price, thank them, and then disconnect the call. The caller's credit card will be immediately charged for the total price of the order, plus the local tax rate for prepared food. The prices for orders made with SCP-971 are always comparatively lower than prices for other popular fast food chains in the caller's current location. Once the call disconnects, about 15 or 20 minutes will pass. Afterwards, a paper bag with Quick and Ready Meals logo, designated SCP-971-1, will appear near the caller. SCP-971-1 almost always appears when all potential observers' attention and vicinity is diverted elsewhere. Remote video observation of SCP-971-1's appearance has been reasonably successful, although not particularly informative. SCP-971-1 simply appears instantaneously with no visual indication of its method or delivery. SCP-971-1 will contain the same items chosen in the phone menu, and all items will be cooked and prepared to normal food safety and inspection service health standards. Aside from the method of delivery, the only other anomalous feature of the food delivered is the meat used for the listed burgers, sandwiches, and other meat-containing items. The meat used in the food is from assorted animals on the EEC Endangered Species list. Further DNA testing on the meat, as well as reports of sudden weight loss and muscle mass loss in animals from several zoos, confirms meat from pandas, cheetahs, red wolves, sand cats, and several other species recognized as endangered. Currently, all meat tested from meals that SCP-971 provides are from animals that are commonly known endangered species to the general public, not the more esoteric endangered species such as the equatorial dog-faced bat or the Oklahoma cave amphipod. The food does not seem to cause any compulsion to eat it, nor does eating the endangered animal fast food meals cause any overt physical harm to subject eating it, save for the high fat, sodium, and calorie counts associated with fast food. The menu itself causes no compulsion to use it over other fast food menus in double-blind testing, and has shown no ability to teleport or reproduce when left alone. Occasionally, other copies of SCP-971 are found outside of Foundation control, as scanned and printed copies of SCP-971 have the same abnormal properties of the original. These copies are to be confiscated and destroyed. Due to the lack of memetic effects or mobility from SCP-971, this SCP is considered safe and requires only minimal containment procedures. Any further testing with SCP-971 is on hold due to possible harm to endangered species and due to minimal data gathered during testing.